Hello, this is a quick video for my communication students to show them how to join our classes group on Quizlet.com. There are a few different ways to join Quizlet groups, but I'll just be talking about one way, which is by accepting an invitation. When someone creates a group on Quizlet, they have the option to invite people they know to join the group, and that's exactly what I did. I created a group for our class, and then I sent you each an invitation. And let's see, here is the kind of invitation you received. It has my name, my email address, and a link to click um, to join. So let's see, just click that link and it will open a new window in your web browser. There we go, a little slow, but it's coming. And when the window opens, depending on which browser you use, I use Chrome, you might need to, there, click the right window. So here we are. This is the window you're looking for. It has our group's name right here, and it also has a little information about the group, so you'll know you're in the right place. If you're already a member of Quizlet, you just need to log in. You can also log in with Facebook, um, but I'm not going to demonstrate that. I'm going to show you what to do if you are not already a member of Quizlet. So, if you're not already a member, you need to sign up. So click Sign Up, and here too, let's see, you can choose to sign up with Facebook, but again, I'm, I'm not going to do that, I'm just going to do it the regular way. First step is to enter a birthday. This just makes sure that young children can't sign up. You can give your real birthday, or you can just make up a month and day, but you need to make sure that you give your real year, because that way we can be sure that um, your registration goes through. It's just a way of making sure that um, you're old enough to use the site. So here, I'll just choose a middle number there. All right, and next you can just choose a user name, and I am going to see if this works. We'll see if it's already used. We'll see if that gets through. I might have to change it. And then you just enter a password. And I'm gonna enter my super secret password. Then you enter it again to make sure you typed it the way you meant to type it. Aha, and here it's possible that your email address will already be here, but if it isn't, then you need to enter it. Do, 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 do. I'm typing with one hand here. Okay, and then you just need to click Agree. And if you want to read about the terms of the service, just click here, and then it'll give you. Um, it'll tell you what you're agreeing to. And then you're ready to sign up. Oh shoot! So that didn't work. I'm going to have to change the username a little bit. Um, can only... Okay. Do, do, do. Okay, let's see if this works. Now sign up. Looks good. Great, and um, I'm going to end it here, and I will make a second video that will show you a few more things about using Quizlet. Um, I'll go over a little bit of this page and then also show you how to use the, the vocabulary words that I've entered. So I hope it was helpful, and be sure to click like if you liked the video, and um, good luck and happy studying!